if you'd like to enjoy some beautiful classical music to kick off your weekend, you're in luck. The Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra opens its indoor season tomorrow night at 7.30 in the Capitol Theater. Two American Masters features two extraordinary women musicians. Master Andrew Sewell is here, along with Joe Lanis, the CEO of the Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra. Welcome back. Were we just on the square? <laughs> it feels like <laughs> it. it. Just seems like time ago. Good to see you both. Nice to be Great back. To see you. And a lot of people can, you know, associate the Chamber Orchestra with Concert on the Score, but you have an indoor season as well. We do at the Capitol Theatre. We do five indoor series. Um, our first one kicks off tomorrow at 7.30, and as you mentioned in the broadcast, it features two American women. Uh, First of all, our soloist, Alyssa Lee Colyonen, is performing the violin solo in Brooks' Scottish Fantasy. And in the second half, we're performing Symphony No. 1 by Florence Price. She is known as the first African-American woman composer to have her work performed by a major symphony orchestra, Chicago, in 1933. Wow. So it's a, it's a very important occasion that we're hearing these works and we're really happy to be performing them. And it, the music, her music is in the style of Dvorak. Uh, mm -hmm. It's very late 19th century romantic. She wrote a total of four symphonies. So we're really excited about this opening. Never, heard, never heard of her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and what designates them as American masters? Well, exactly. Well, uh, shall we say, um, uh, forgotten? Is that tenure? Uh, well, true. I, I mean, these, this is a marketing ploy, but I, I think that in terms of when you hear their music, you really, they are of the highest quality. So uh, in terms of a symphony, it's, it's important that major orchestra like the Philadelphia Orchestra has recorded all four of her symphonies and now it's getting airplay and uh, for a while there they were lost in a, in, a, in a house in Illinois and only discovered in a trunk in the late O's and since then her, mu her music has come to light and published and then performed since oh, 2019. What a great story. Mm -hmm. And so these, this indoor series is, is imp as important for the chamber as Conscious on the Square, maybe not as big of an audience, mm. but it's an important series for you. Yeah, so we're best known for concerts on the square, but what the musicians and Andrew put on for our community during our masterwork season is, is simply extraordinary. It's, it's acoustically very different. Capital Theater, the aesthetics is different. Um, so if you haven't experienced it, you got to come check this out because the intimacy and the connection to the music is just extraordinary. So this is our first full season since the 2018-2019 season. We have five full concerts. Uh, tomorrow night's our first of five. You can still subscribe for as little as $28 per ticket. And um, it's just, a, Andrew's just again put on a stellar season, so we hope everyone comes out tomorrow night. You can go to Overture box office tomorrow, the downbeat's at 7.30. And you, know, if you don't have to worry about the weather. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 rain no, rain right. no rain day. No rain day tomorrow. What are some of the other concerts coming up? Well, we've got another concert in February, March, uh, and then uh, sort of January, February, March, and then in May, early May. So they're all exciting programs with uh, stellar soloists that we can all enjoy. Looking forward to it. Yeah. Some great music I had for all of us. Mm -hmm. Again, it's the first concert is tomorrow night. 7.30. Night. And tickets are available at the Overture, Overture Box, Box Office. Correct. Yep. Have a great season. Great to yeah. see you both. Thank you.